I could show you some cool stuff about building. I would love that. Because my vision is that I would like to take a piece of land and utilize the ancient principles, which, you know, starts with things like simple but really cool, like putting a pole in the ground and using that pole to determine the directions and all the alignments. And you don't just build at random. You orient it towards the sky like they always did. That's a universal principle we find over and over in every continent. Hold on, how do you do that with a pole then? And what are you orienting it to? So first thing you do is you put a pole in the ground and then you would draw a circle around it. Now in the old days, they would use a knotted rope or a chain with links and you could determine the length of the chain by the number of links. And typically, a lot of the chains that came from Europe, the links were carefully manufactured to be 0.792 degrees, which is interesting because then you get certain numbers like 7,920 inches. And that gives you some interesting geometric correlations. But anyways. Like what? Well, correlations like one of the ancient units of measurement is a furlong. And the only place that I know that a furlong is still used today is in horse racing. It's one eighth of a mile, 660 feet. Well, if you translate that into inches, it's 7,920 inches. Now, interestingly, if you took the earth, you know, the earth is not perfectly spherical. It's rotating. So its mass moves towards the equator. It's called an oblate spheroid. The diameter of the earth varies by 26 miles. The equator is 26 miles longer than the polar diameter. No so, shit, I yeah. had no idea. Yeah, hey, if it wasn't for that, man, we'd be screwed. The Earth would be wobbling all over the fucking place. You can think of it this way. If you traveled from the equator to the North Pole, you've gone downhill by 13 miles. Interesting. Yeah. So that oblateness, it acts like a fly flywheel that stabilizes the Earth. Yeah. But that number shows up in a bunch of other interesting places as well. Wow. Fascinating stuff, isn't it? Isn't it, though? Yeah. 